Well, on this Friday the 13th, nothing frightful about our weather here. Lots of sunshine, no full moon either this evening. Looking at a waning crescent, about 39% uh, visible uh, from the moon. But if you're heading out this evening, the weather going to be looking uh, pretty good for any of those plans you may be having tonight. If you're heading out to Friday night football, looking at some clear skies across both of our north and south shores. Less humid as well. Temperatures, though, a little warm still, low to mid 80s around a kickoff time, so weather looking pretty good for that. Maybe heading out to Oktoberfest over at Bayou St. John last until 11 o'clock. Nice conditions there as well. Still warm and humid though with temperatures into the upper 80s and we've been enjoying this nice weather and it's been feeling very summer like so maybe you want to head off to the beach down toward Grand Isle, Biloxi, Pensacola. Lots of sunshine expected. Some breezy winds though out of the east about 15 to 20 miles per hour and breezy over toward Pensacola, but a good day trip to get out and enjoy uh, these warm temperatures. We've had some records once again. Slidell 91, New Orleans, the Kenner Airport tying the record of 89. That was back in 2014 in most areas mid to upper 80s. Some low 90s though across the North Shore as well. That's about to change over the next several days. If you're looking for more of that fall like feel, you're going to get it going into the beginning parts of next week. There's a cold front going to kind of linger for several days across the central plains and then push toward the south. So for now, we've got high pressure bringing lots of sunshine across our area. So things quiet across most of the area. A few showers trying to get going there in the parts of Harrison County, but overall expecting a dry evening for most as we see this high pressure slowly going to start to push toward the east. So as we get that, we start to get a little more moisture streaming back in. Winds are going to shift to the southeast and so the humidity going to start rising once again. We'll see a few isolated showers possibly down near the coast uh, going throughout the day on Saturday. So if you are heading out to the poles, I think the weather for the most part going to cooperate and upper low moving across the Gulf of Mexico will bring some better rain chances on Sunday. Still only at about a 30% chance for some coverage. We'll see a cold front diving in from the north and that'll increase rain chances as well going through the early morning hours on Monday. Once the front clears the area, say about mid morning, high pressure will start to take control once again and this one will be bringing some drier and cooler air down. Talking some temperatures falling into the 70s for our high temperatures and we get rid of some of that humidity as well. So the timing on that, you see the cool Cool temperatures behind the front as it finally pushes across the area. We see some temperatures dropping. Uh, we'll see 60s and 50s for there it goes. Finally updated there mid to upper 50s for parts of the North Shore and the South Shore. Some upper 40s a little bit further off toward the north. So some chilly temperatures if I can say that could be arriving for the beginning parts of the week. Tropic update. We've got a 30% chance for tropical development. This area of low pressure uh, just toward the east um, of the Leeward Islands that will continue to make a track toward the west northwest and then eventually turn toward the north. So there is that possibilities for a little bit of development out of this, mainly as we go toward the three to five day period. So got some very warm temperatures out into the Atlantic and not seeing too much wind shear, uh, which helps to cut off the storms going through that three to five day period. So just something to watch, but right now not posing any threat to the US and then Ophelia with winds of 100 miles per hour still moving off uh, toward the northeast and that one will be moving away from the US as well. Check out your seven day forecast and again, we'll We'll see some slight rain chances for Sunday in the beginning parts of Monday. Check out the nice temperatures though as we go toward the middle parts of the week. Some 50s, low to mid 60s and highs only into the 70s going to be feeling quite pleasant.